Hi. I'm Liz with the Riz. I'm back. Hello. We just basically were just introduced in the, into the story and into the setting, I would say. We are banishers. We are basically ghost hunters for hire. And we've been called to this place called New Eden, where we are supposed to banish a curse, which is just a, probably a nightmare. Apparently the most treacherous of all ghosts. And there's no report of actually being you being able to banish them in the first place, so it's gonna be interesting. Um, but I'm I'm optimistic. <laughs> and we started with Antea, uh, who is the the boss, so to say, of the of the two people party of banishers. And now we are playing her apprentice and lover, Red. Mm, let's go. Continue. I love his hairstyle, by the way. I think that looks pretty cool. Okay. Oh, if you double tap, then you're rolling. Interesting. I don't think they taught me that yet. <laughs> yeah, put that sword away, sir. Find Antea. Where are you? Well, You're not in the meeting house, are you? The holy moon. What is going on there? And the way the fog is moving, it's not... Oh, this is still a nightmare, is it? We're trapped in a nightmare, I think. Just don't waste your healing potions again. No promises can be made. <laughs> All right, let's go. Yeah, the moon is unrealistically big. And the, the fog and the... Who's there? And there? Where? You know, you have this kind of... It looks like northern lights, but they're a bit too far low. It looks like we are, we are trapped in this area, in this zone. Why would you go up there alone? Yeah, why would you? So that I have to follow you in the dark. Woman. I'm hoping. And here. The path to the meeting house is closed by the governor's degree. Come on, just hop over. No, I did it again. <laughs> See? No promises can be made. I don't suppose you specters have seen Antea, have you? Accidentally took my health potion again. <laughs> this is gonna this is gonna happen for some time, I can promise you that. <laughs> Ow! Son of a gun! Was it her second the one? Boss and all included me. Just destroying the stuff that's in the way. Turn off the healing button. <laughs> oh my god. It's just that it, it reminds me so much of Witcher, so I in my head I use the Witcher um the Witcher buttons, which doesn't work <laughs> naturally. Ooh, an Alpha Wandra. Wandra, I'm the Wanderer. I go round and round and round and round and round. And round. Give me that. Oh, I could have banished him. So banishing is really removing them permanently from the world. If you don't banish, they keep coming back. Do I understand this correctly? <laughs> Wax waxy cap agaric, okay, some mushroom. In combat, the banish mechanic is actually, is usually a finish or just takes a decent chunk of health. Okay, so it's basically like a, a very strong attack, okay. Oh, 
how they run, see how they run, run, red, run, run, see how they run, red. That's run. me. See how they creepy. Very Me creepy. Blind mice. See how they run. See how they. <gasps> there. Blind. All blind. <laughs> Red, can't you see? We never stood a chance. Matea, you hurt? Where are you? I'm here, my love. What happened? Why? <laughs> Uh oh. <laughs> I'm here, my love. How mundane. Show yourself. God came to the man you. in a dream and said, Behold, thou art dead. But the man had done nothing wrong and said, Lord, wilt thou also slay the righteous? What? Yeah. She was the nightmare. Just like with the widow, Esther. Yo. Will you slay the righteous? Be not alarmed. I bring you aid. There is no aid. There is only dereliction. Where is Antea? What have you done with her? That was Too close. close. Lady, if you hurt her, you cling to love, the fool to the last. There is no love. There is only defilement. You get, get your finger out of my heart, ma'am, right now. <laughs> get it out of there. Any healings anymore, I just have one. Will be consumed. There's no need to fight. Okay, she's just a mirror. Are you the real one? Oh no! Come here, I banish you! What do I do with you? What do I do? Bam! Now I poke your heart! How's that feel, huh? Oh crap. She knocked me down, she knocked me down. Ooh. Oh crap, how do I... Hi! And dead. No, no drop, no drop, no! Oh, I messed up the night. If you laid a finger on her, you know what? Come to her aid. Oh, there is no aid. There is oh, only the fireman. Yeah, yeah. Oh, retribution. Oh, give okay. him back. How touching! You come to claim your man. You think you love him. You do not. 
There, in the dark of your marrow, there is no love, only betrayal. I offer you a trade. He stays and you leave with your life. I'll bargain with no ghost. You have a brain, yet you think with your idiot heart. You're weak. Shit, I was right. I called it. No. Will you come to her aid now, when all is lost? What? If you do, I'll be waiting. What is that intro? The icy ocean made a diamond from his grief, then buried it in his heart. The weight of his failure dragged him down. Me too. Outside time, drowning in the gloom, he spoke her name. Banishers, Ghosts of New Eden, what a fucking intro, mate. <sighs> Take me instead, he screamed, soundless, to the cold and silent waters. Out beyond the black veil of death, something heard his cries and reached for him. Oh. Let her go. Take me instead. Let her go! Is that a memory? Was How much time has passed between those events? Ah, you're awake. Who are you? She who rescued you. Tended you for days on end. Weeks, maybe. Weeks? What have I done? Get your strength back before you beat yourself up. She's dead. Yes. That's why you're here. And why I was sent to look after you. Who are you? I feel like we've met, but... I'm sure we have not. I feel like I know you forever. But do I? You're confused. It's normal. You've been near killed by a nightmare, you've lost your beloved, and now you've a witch by your sickbed. Witch? Witch. I go by Seeker. Find the Banisher, said my mistress. Tend him, and answer any questions he asks you before you leave him be. So, how do you feel? Does it matter? Of course it matters. It means you're alive, and you haven't given up. Oh man, what a start. Oh, God. But she said, over my dead body, and I was like, oh no, she's gonna die. And he was more prone to having pity with the dead. So I have a feeling, I mean, might be wrong about this, but I have a feeling that she, Antea will manifest as a ghost and she will come with him. 
so he will not banish her. He will he will keep her ghost with him, maybe? I don't know. I'm just thinking out loud. Who sent you? Who sent you? Her name is Ceridian, and my hands and words are hers. Beyond that, don't burden yourself. <laughs> the alternative, who is she? Or the alternative is, you should have let me die. I don't know, who is she? Sir Hadin, this little seeker who asked you to find me, is she Scots or something? It's Sir Ridian. She's too old to be from anywhere in particular. And while, yes, I found you, she told me where to look. This nightmare, how it spoke, how it tore right through. I've never seen the like of it. Few have. Fewer have lived to tell of it. What drew such a powerful spirit here? Who knows? Something awful, I don't doubt. The worst angers rise from the most terrible wrongs. A friend said that. He's trying to warn us. An immutable law. You have wise friends. I wonder who heard the nightmare so that she became a nightmare in the first place. She doesn't really seem to believe in love and she feels betrayed, I think. So maybe she had a lover and was betrayed and now she's always targeting people who love, especially. Hmm. What am I to do now? How do I? How do I do it alone? You're not alone. Have faith. If Ceridian had told me more, I'd tell you it. But you must have faith. Easy said, harder done. <laughs> have faith. You say that you do not know me. Easy said, harder done. What comes easy in life tends not to matter. It's the hard stuff that counts. Mm. You've True. a hole in you, a yawning, grimacing pit in your soul. That's love, that is. The hole won't fill because the love won't die. God, what have I done? Here's the thing. Unlike most, you get a second chance. I suggest you seize it. Why do you hate me? I serve my mistress. She bids me help you, so I help you. Ceridian says the wall between the living and the dead is under threat. You, it seems, have a part to play. This is mine. You've lost me. No, I found you. <laughs> but so did your grief. And it demands to be felt. You may think you're done with your ghosts, Red McCraith. But they aren't done with you. I'll go now. Rest. Why ever my mistress saved you, she has good reasons. The best. Where are you going? Away. Home. To Ceridian. She needs me. Where shall I find you if... Or when I need to? Maya marshes. Great big swamps other side of the woods. You can't miss them. We'll know when you're coming. Till we meet again, then. That's right, Banisher. Now, turn around. What? I'm leaving. Okay. And you're not supposed to see in which direction? Ooh, nice magic trick. Death to the dead, quest completed, find your way. Oh my god. I really liked her, you know. I really liked Anteo. <laughs> Inspect. 
Okay, let me grab my things before I leave. Benosha, if you read this, it means that, one, you have enough brain to know your alphabet. <laughs> Two, you have not resisted going through what I left behind. Three, you may take whatever you deem useful since my mistress wants you to live. We shall meet soon enough. Until then, be well, Seeker. Thanks. The origins of banishers. Exorizon, an exorcism. From the old Greek root, alemon, a wanderer, to the Latin exulo, an exiler, to the Frankish banjan, an exiler or banisher, the wandering exiler, the banisher. In ancient Greece, was was there the Metragertes, <laughs> a cult of wandering beggar priests. From place to place went they, singing songs and banging drums, that the spirits of the dead be calmed. It fits The music fits very well now. <clears throat> or set free, or exiled. This they did in honor of the long dead. Thracian magician Orpheus, he whose love for Eurydice was so powerful that he followed her through the land of the dead and into the abyss, won her freedom, and near brought her back. As the world grew, so too did the knowledge of these sons and daughters of Orpheus, but some did not embrace the new wisdom. They learned not and remained forever beggar priests. Through shapes and patterns seen and heard, from antiquity to modern times, these wanderers used the hidden laws of the universe to open the gates and send the spirits of the dead away. To serve the living, the banishers destroy the dead. But they know little. They have forgotten their parentage. They have lost touch with we who see the colors and the shades of all the light and all the dark, the good and the bad and everything living and dead the banishers have their uses yes as a hammer has its use when driven a nail must be but the hammer does not care about the plank or the nail nor does it understand it is made of the same wood and iron the banishers know nothing of the hem for they are not and might never be one of us they do not stand between the world of women and men and everlasting darkness they do not minister to the dead so that the living may live they do not know for they are not witches they are yet the children of Orpheus, and they do not look back. Hmm. I don't know what this is, but I'm staying away from it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> know your limits. Yay, we have enough brain to read! What is this, a fast travel point? Where am I? Good question, but it looks pretty cool here. Wow, I'm... <laughs> I'm a bit shooketh. They introduce you this very cool character, you even start with that character and then they just kill it off. Very nasty. Oh, this area looks so pretty. There's light. Let me look in this corner first. Okay, nothing. Oh, there's a wisp. Hi. How can I reach you? Can I go into the water? No, I cannot. What can I do with you? Hmm. Hmm. I don't know if, if I can do anything with this right now. It looks quite different from the last time that I was doing it. It's a later thing? Okay. Where the lady at? Which one? The witch or the vanisher? Damn it. What am I doing here? Windy path discovered. Oh, we need resources for some banishing stuff.
<laughs> Spoilers. <laughs> Looks like I'm supposed to go this way, but I see shiny stuff. Nice. I like shiny. Pyrite? Pyrite. Okay. Running. Oh, this area is so pretty. Lilac Hyacinth, all right. All you can do is make today and tomorrow better than yesterday. Yup. It doesn't really help to dwell too much in the past, but since the past is so fresh still, I can understand. I would mourn as well. Trouble. Oh, the moss and everything. Oh, this is so pretty. Whee! Oh, God, fella, now is not the time. Threat indicator. The threat indicator points to enemies that are out of sight. The different colors indicate different behaviors. Red, incoming attack. Orange, incoming projectile. Green, incoming possession. Possession? I can be possessed. I do not like that. Oh, he did. There's another one. Ow. Oh, the way he moved. I already what the hell am I doing? That's a very weird and twisted and skinny dog. Oh, we oh level points. Okay, they're skilling, I guess. Sweet. Okay. So I haven't even seen the skill tree yet. <laughs> Red is being possessed by Liz. Yeah, I control him. Seize control. Evolution? You cannot access this menu for now. I assume evolution is what they mean for the skill tree, right? They wanted a, f uh, a fancy name for, for skill tree, I guess. Ugh. Gosh, half rotten corpse. Oh dear. Please don't make me balance. Please don't make me balance. Don't make- oh. Okay. This is fine. This is fine. This is fine. This is fine. Oh. Not a big fan of heights. Am I the last bloody living soul here? Well, now that we killed the wolves, yeah, sure. <laughs> oh, I found a chest! Come on. I'm running. More who fungus. Hmm. Imagine a little hut here somewhere. That is some fast as climbing. <laughs> oh, more fighting. <gasps> Alpha wolf. That is a big wolf indeed. <laughs> Oh, I cannot banish you, but I can hit you! Ow. There's more coming? Oh crap, I interrupted my own attack. Oh my god. Hang on, let me chuck this <laughs> in the middle of the fight. Om nom nom.
what is happening? What? That's here. Oh my god, am I right with this as well? <laughs> Another skill point? Ooh. I'm leveling up fast. So she has unfinished business, she's coming back. And I keep her as my guardian spirit. Please, that'd be cool. I'd, I'd like that dynamic. Do I go? It doesn't want me to go this way, but I don't know if this is extra. Let me just have a look. Oh yeah, more fighting. of the earth. Find Antea, so I'm really finding her. Oh god. I mean, at least you went out with a good view. Always look on the bright side of life. You know? Okay, let's find a... Uh, this way. <laughs> I like how they went with this y white um, and yellow markings here. It's not... I know it's not painted on. I've, I don't know the English word for it. So cold. So cold. Where am I? In the world between, I guess. Oh, there! It's here. Oh god. I mean he knows ghosts exist, so could be her. And it's definitely her voice. This isn't happening. This can't be happening. <laughs> Hi, welcome and enjoy your coffee. Antea, call me to you. Where am I? Where am I? I don't know. Aloha, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh God, he must be so guilt-ridden. how yellow became the default you can climb on this color in, in a lot of games white or yellow yeah or like just the the color to lead you on to guide you a bit i'm here wow. lead me to you mystical caves discovered such a good adventurer oh Fire fist. To hell. Oh crap. Spectres. Here. Matea, are you there? Okay, there's an object, a memory. Oh, there she is. Right here, my love, right here. Oh, 
is you. I have you. You have me. Mom. No, don't go. Reunion. I'm here. Follow me. Okay. But don't trick me. Where are you going? Over here. No trickery though, okay? Oh god, this is so pretty. I have you. I'm right here. Where are you? Where have you gone? Antea! Come back. These things, are they fast travel points? Can I do something with you? This is just like a fancy lamp. Oh, it's getting really dark in here. Almost there. You seem weak. You need... Rest. I feel hollow. Wow, he's good at making fires. Do not be troubled. How could I not be? Lost you and found you like this. And you're hungry. That's one way to say it. Yes. What can I do? Charles's Bible, the tie that bound his ghost. remains upon it. For now, it will do me. Am I feeding her essence? Um, I needed this. I feel better. Look at you. At us. I know. Don't get me wrong. I'm glad you're here. I'm glad you're back. Truly. The living should not truck with the dead. I've known that since childhood. I learned the hard way. You never told me this. What happened? Do tell. Story time. It was a lifetime ago. For now, it doesn't matter. Are you still hungry? How are you feeling? How are you feeling? Awful. And with a few more words? Angry. Frustrated. Useless. We should talk about what happened. After the meeting house, I mean. What do you remember? 
What do you remember from after you died? I remember the suddenness of my death. I remember nothing, but After that, a nothingness. Timeless. Lost. And then I heard you. You spoke my name. I searched for a way back. I woke up in a cave. Been rescued by a young woman named Seeker. A witch's apprentice. She was proud to tell me that. <laughs> Her mistress had sent her to take care of me. Witches rarely show themselves. Intriguing that one would help us. We should go back to New Eden Town. We should run away. We should go back and finish this. I think we should go back to New Eden Town. I agree. To free me, I believe we must reclaim my body. I refuse to be this way. I'll not abide it. I'm so sorry, my love. How can I help? I'm a ghost. You're a banisher. I'll not banish you. I cannot and tear. So you die. You can't ask that of me. If that's what I wanted, you'd have no choice. But you don't wish it, do you? Not before I've had my revenge. Not before I've seen mm. the nightmare defeated by Heck you and yeah. me both. Could I bring you back? Could I give you a scent? Uh, could I bring you back? <laughs> In the schoolhouse, he joked about bringing me back to life. Is that possible? Yes. The ritual of lesser palingenesis. It's extremely difficult. Highly dangerous. I could try, right? You teach me. I'd bring you back. Red. It's an ancient ritual. It requires power. It consumes essence in large quantities. We're talking about human sacrifice. Murder. Just maybe. We could consider it. I mean, if there's the slightest chance I could bring you back, I'd take it. It's a dark ritual, Red. It's tempting, and that's dangerous. To think of being back in your arms. I'm tempted too. But maybe there's like a human scumbag that we could sacrifice for it. Yay? Could I give you your ascent? That would be the simplest solution, but not the easiest. Why? My body is my tie, and the nightmare still holds it. Mm -hmm. In the meeting house, but before she let me fall, I swear she dared me to come back. She's as devious as she is powerful. She won't just hand it over. Then what shall we do? If we are to return to New Eden Town, we must first learn more about our enemy. Charles said nightmares don't appear without good reason. Yes, we have a mystery to solve. Witches to meet, people to find, and questions to ask. And then you'll help me go, one way or another. I will. I swear it, Mother. Rest. You need it. I'll stay close. Unveil. Antea can allow Red to see the world from the other side of the veil and uncover ethereal elements such as spectral stains or webs. Ooh. In combat, Antea can deal increased damage to possessed corpses. The unveil manifestation has been unlocked after the consumption of the essence soaking Charles Ty. Okay. And now I can decide what I want to unlock with my skill points. Tag team. The fourth... Light attack triggers a punch attack that ignores resistance. Ooh. Pocket of holding. Maximum decoction charges is increased by one. That might not be bad for me, to be honest. But I might just drink them away anyways. Invigorate. Banishing an enemy increases the damage of the next heavy attack by 200%. <whistles> Unrelenting. Each enemy hit by a light attack increases the damage of light attacks by 10%. This effect can be accumulated. Resets on being hit. 
I have two, right? And this costs two, uh, one, and this costs one. Because I really like um, light attacks, not because I prefer not doing much damage, but usually because they're way faster. I like, in general, I prefer fast fightings, uh, fighting stance, uh, styles. Oh, 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 now everything is unlocked. Swift banish. Banish points gains are increased by 20%, but banish damage is reduced by 20 Oh, that sucks. <laughs> Trade-offs. Charged heavy attacks trigger an area of effect dealing physical damage. Oh, that is pretty epic. Ooh, all of them are pretty cool. Oh, I want to do them all. I want to get them all, guys. Ooh. Unrelenting. Each enemy hit by light attack increases the damage of light. I'm gonna go with this one. I'm gonna I'm gonna go with light text first. <laughs> Stiff neck. Sleeping on the ground there. Upgrade your equipment. Shelters allow you to upgrade your equipment via the inventory menu. Inventory and evolution. Consult and modify your talents and presences. Fast travel and rest. Inventory. Upgrades available three. Ooh. Upgrade your equipment. Upgrading your equipment improves their bonuses and requires resources. You can access the upgrades menu by hovering an equipment slot and pressing X. Melee attack damage is increased by 5%. Upgrade available. Saber and Firebane. The fourth light attack and heavy attack damage is increased by 50%. Oh man, this is all pretty cool. Untear strength. Health recovery, speed recovery. Damage taken by red is reduced by 5%. Bane's ring. Damage taken is reduced by five. Okay, I can't do this yet. How often can I do this? Upgrades. Oh, there's, oh God, this seems rather complex. Melee attack damage is increased. Mm -hmm. Okay. So everything has multiple attacks. Cortador and Ascua. Upgrades. No, wait, that was this overview that I had before. This. Common rudimentary. I need spec more spectral dust. Hmm. Okay, so I guess the first thing that we gotta do is upgrade my outfit, right? Ah, unlimited power, upgrade an item. <laughs> Getting ahead of ourselves here. Unlimited power. What's with the inventory? Veins ring, blah, 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 blah. damage taken is reduced and damage taken is reduced. Okay, so. Let's upgrade this as well. Sweet, looks like we're done with this. Or it still shows something with the inventory. Ah, here. This is. I'm also supposed to upgrade this one. Okay. <whistles> the way she looks at her rings. I like how they s switch positions and like that. How they look at each other. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool, cute, and cool. Cool. Oh, I thought she was just gone. That would have been a cool transition. Find an exit. I just did not do that. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, I, g I gotta sit down again. On to New Eden, whichever way it lies. We'll need provisions. 
Going for the basics. Will matter. Sorry. Wait, there was something on the top that I could have done. Oh, crap. Hmm. <gasps> Dang it. What do I got to do to ref... Oh, screw it. <laughs> this playthrough, I will not be able to heal a lot because I'm constantly misclicking. But it's the first day I will get the hang of the controls. Listen, the healing potions. It's just, I, I played um, a month of Tomb Raider... Um, remastered, so my my fingers are like they try to tomb raid, right? <laughs> Raiding tombs and stuff. What the hell happened here? Looks like somebody tried to perform a ritual. Well, if you're gonna play with salt circles, you better get them right, lad. <laughs> I love the Scottish accent. Amazing. Demonologist's note. 14th of September. Do you remember? During one of our explorations of these new lands on which we first set foot many years ago, Angerad and I discovered a new place, a special place, a cave hidden behind a waterfall where none would find it. A strange feeling of lightness drew us to it as though the veil between the incarnate and the invisible was as thin as the finest French silk. From the chamber em emanated the power of the other world. Surely, we thought, this was a fine place for ritual experimentation. The cave was larger than we had fir at first thought, containing a multitude of galleries. Angered and I decided to take young Shelley along with us to continue our exploration. Pleasant bust but ungifted, his father insisted that he train with experienced cultists. What a surprise it was when we found the mushrooms we needed for our rituals growing on the walls. We set about collecting them while I drew the symbols and prepared the rituals. We felt our powers magnified tenfold. One page missing. 18th of September. The cave is vast and dangerous. I heard whispers in the darkness. Something watches us. Neither Belden nor Shelley can hear them, or so they say. But something lurks, I'm sure of it. Perhaps I'm wrong. Perhaps the feather I had some weeks ago yet lingers. Last night I caught young Shelley watching us sleep. He was talking to himself. He was unnerving. Oh boy, this sounds unnerving indeed, yes. I see no bodies. Maybe the wolves took him. I Can see you blood. not see the symbols on the wall? No. Take my hand. Oh. I want to try something. Oh. Is that possible through our bane rings? They allow us to connect the invisible and the incarnate. Through this bond, what I see I bestow on you. Are those webs made of spectral stains? Let me. Spectral web. Press A to remove spectral webs and reveal shrouded objects of places. Ooh. All these years, the things we must have missed. The dead hide more from the living than we thought. This is going to be helpful. Key to... Oh, dang it. Key to occultists. Uh, uh, uh -huh, here. Key to occultist equipment, a brass key stained with dark blood. Ooh, okay. Where's the loot? I found a key, I want the loot. Keep, 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 keep. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Just breaking stuff as I go. Something's concealed. As a ghost, Antea can unveil and interact with hidden spectral elements. When in close proximity to these elements, your bane rings will be triggered and light up with a blue aura. Use Y to switch to Antea and reveal the hidden source. Oh, and then they automatically switch again. Spectral dust and piece of eight. Ooh, I'm getting rich. Get rich. Ooh, yeah. Ghost power. Yes, get the loot. <laughs> Ooh, are they teaching us how to fight now together? Ooh. 
what's this? Oh, loot. Keep, keep. God, there's gonna be so much looting, guys. Oh! What the heck are you? Uh, and you look weird, sir. They're vexed now. We can fight them together. What? Press RB to perform a punch attack that deals more damage to possessed corpses. Uh huh. Attacking with Antea consumes spirit points. They are re re regenerated by Red's attacks. No, what you look? Where you looking? Punching you. Sit down. <laughs> Sit down. <laughs> awesome. We did it. We did. Thank you. I wasn't much use. Go team. You were. I promise. You'll get better. Things will get better. We'll get better. We'll we'll improve together. Huh? Hi everybody, welcome in. Taya is really useful. I want one. <laughs> Your own and Taya. Friendly little ghost. For now. Ooh. I see a question mark up there, okay. Ready and waiting. Ah, she tells you. Okay, cool. Yeah, like I said, guys, I will have to get used to the controls for a bit, but we'll get there. Scottish accents are so satisfying. Yes, they are. Wish I could probably make one. <laughs> they always... Um, usually dwarves in video games, in fantasy video games, have uh, a Scottish accent. So I always think of dwarves. <laughs> in a way. It's a wee bit sad. Spiritual necklace. Necklace. Can I wear that? Ooh, ooh, that was cool. Can I? Inventory. Can I equip it? Upgrades. Damage taken by Antea is reduced. Uh, uh. Equipments can only be upgraded at shelters. Okay, so she's already wearing it. I guess. Come on. Exit the cave. Uh huh, this is where I went down, okay. Climbing is very fast, but I don't mind, honestly. Especially after the very slow climbing in Tomb Raider. Oh, gee. My god. Ma'am, you scared me. <laughs> well, she's a ghost after all, right? Yeah. Maybe it's her nature. She's like, peekaboo. Leather. Sweet. Sheesh. This is so that's Spectre. It's heading for that corpse. Corpse. Possess an interruption. Spectres may attempt to possess corpses. You can interrupt a possession by attacking the specter before it reaches the corpse. Well, I failed at that. <laughs> I think I used to count my wolf kills on one hand. Mm. 
How, how can you interrupt it? Get back up. Watch out. Spectre possession. Green, it's trying to. Ah! No! What did I do? No, 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 no. Tell him, bastard! Not just now, Eden Town. What happened here for the veil to be so thin? Nah. War, invasion, or colonization of a land that's vulnerable to haunting. Mm. Game so far is great. I already decided to get this game just from the intro alone. Yeah, I watched the trailer just a few days before starting this now, and I was so excited. <laughs> Ghost bastards, exactly. <laughs> no, not ghost, not ghost busters, but ghost bastards. <laughs> Off she went. Hunting gear. <gasps> there might be a lodge nearby. You took yourself up there very fast. That might take some getting used to, for both of us. Mm -hmm. Guys, do we know the voice actress? She, for some reason, when I hear her, I'm thinking of Dishonored. Ugh. Her voice seems so familiar. Maybe some of you guys know. Oh, okay. <laughs> Looked like a cave. Oh god. Sorry, sir, but you don't need it anymore, right? Antea, will people be able to tell I'm haunted? Perhaps. If they had talent or training. What if someone sees you? Unlikely. If they had talent or training, they wouldn't have needed us banishers. <laughs> Fair point. Fair point. Ooh. I wonder what happened to the trappers around here. The woods are swarmed with spectres. Hopefully, they left. Bam! Oh, cool. Sometimes you just get some equipment, resources, whatnot. Mine, 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 mine. All the loot mine. Uh, Amaka Okafor is playing the role of Antea, one of the main characters in Banishers Goes in Eden. It's best known for the, her work in 2023 sci fi thriller Netflix show Bodies. I watched Bodies. That was a good show. Yeah, I just recently watched that. That is a really good mini show. It's like eight episodes or six or so. Really good, really interesting. Be climb, be climb, be climb, be climb. <laughs> oh. These witches you mentioned must know something about the nightmare. Aye, but can we trust them? Well, witches only involve themselves with people if they absolutely have to. Yours must have good reason. Hmm. Such a pretty game, sorry. <laughs> Really cool. That is I so think sweet. I see oh my god. <laughs> over there. Signs of civilization. Look at me. Oh, she she just materialized in front of me, but I was already walking through her, so half my screen was just her head and <laughs> that scared the crap out of me. Oh god, okay, I think we go down here. Nice place. Rules and specters aside. Don't you have wolves and spectres in the highlands? Aye, but I was of the courtesy of letting me catch my breath between fights.
You don't have required manifestation to unlock this path for now. So such obstacles are marked on your map, I guess. Okay. Couldn't read that fast. Zoom, 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 zoom. Bad news. The bridge is out. We'll find another road to New Eden. Strange. I see stains, but not the usual kind. Switch to Antea, okay. There's a pattern to them. Don't you see it? Nope. It calls to me. Wait, do you have to descend into the valley? Do I have to align them now in a, in a, in a good way? I have strong ankles, but at this height, I'm going to make it. I'm confused. I thought maybe I'm gonna jump down here. No, okay. Uh, um. I have strong ankles, but at this height, we're gonna make it. Okay, okay, but. Uh -huh. And up and down we go. Those stains. I could have grasped at them had I been stronger. It's hard to think clearly. The hunger is back, and it's growing fast. Already? Wow. Right, let's find something to sustain you. The Ends of the Earth quest completed. Ew, what the heck? Lara Croft could ace that job. Yep, she could. <laughs> but alas, she ain't here. Hungry. Hungry the hunters. Level four skill point, but I need to be in a camp to actually skill, right? There's one, it seems. Maybe we just quickly run there and use it. Or maybe that's what I'm supposed to do anyways? Seems like it. <laughs> There's someone inside. Someone tainted. Okay. Someone tainted. Now I'm just gonna come in and break all their shit. <laughs> and take what I find. I can smell this. <laughs> ben, you're back. I'm not Ben. Hi. Beg pardon. I thought you were someone else. Figured, yes. He's not really cautious, turning his back you on a stranger. Me, friend? The stew is thin enough, but I'd be glad to share. Oh, how sweet. Kind of you to offer, lad. But no, thank you. Been a while since I've seen another human's face. You come from camp? You a hunter? Of sorts. Red McCraith. I'm a banisher. Like in the stories. Jacob Lind. I'm a trapper. <laughs> That's a real job. Are you saying mine is not? <laughs> what, what are you doing here? 
What are you doing here? Had you nowhere safer? The woods are kind to them as knows them. We hunt here. When we get pelts and meat, we trade in New Eden. But game's been scarce. We've not to trade, so we wait. When even the wolves are starving, you know it's going to be a bad winter. This isn't winter. Winter? This is June. Is it? I could have sworn it was... Ooh, okay. I'm sorry. On my own, I lose track of time. And with your friend? Oh. You met Ben, did you? He was just here, he was. Just here. Look exhausted. You're exhausted. I'm surprising given how tainted are these woods. Are you sleeping? I don't like sleeping. I see things. Bright eyes in the leaves. What does tainted mean? Marked by ghosts. Haunted. Tell me of your nightmares. One nightmare. Always the same one. Ben has it too. Would you care to share them? No! No! It is a nightmare. Nothing more. Yeah, that's the problem. It's a nightmare. <laughs> Who's Ben? Another trapper? Hi, the best of them. Taught me all I know. He's out now, but he'll be back. Where has he gone? The bridge is down. As down as down can be. Can't cross. Bad things lurk in the shadows. They sent flesh. Game's low. Game's low and Ben's gone. He'll find game, he will. I know it. How did you meet Ben? What lurks in the shadows? What lurks in the shadows? Is that what keeps you here? That... and the fog. Can't hunt if you can't see. True. Ben shoots better than me. Knows the woods better too. I'd only slow him. Only slow him. Where did you meet Ben? We found each other. Brothers in spirit, he said. He's been good to me. Too good. Why? He's important to you. I? And me to him. He's lost his nerve. Or a ghost has taken it from him. Something yes, is fishy rest, here. Jacob. You need it. If you see Ben, tell him I'm thinking of him. Tall lad, even when he's lying down. Can't miss him. Poor child. He's shrouded in spectral stains. Haunting cases. You have started your first haunting case and must investigate the ghost that haunts Jacob Lind. Use the notification shortcut. It will open your hauntings case menu to follow this investigation. Haunting cases. Jacob Lind's friend, Benedict Stoughton, brings him food. Let's follow that. Damn it, I the flesh is weak. What's this? Your meat's turning, friend. Food is scarce. We might do. He's but not fussy. His meat is crawling. Disgusting. Are these Ben's things? Most of them. Not the rope. You can have it if you want. Kind of you. Thank you. All right. The sturdy rope is mainly used to descend safely from dangerous cliffs. Ha! <laughs> the one area that I couldn't go through. Ben went out without a gun. We're trappers, not hunters. We had the gun for safety, but it got damp. Done work. Hmm. Right, what's this? Genesis 9, Jacob's Bible. And God blessed Noah and his sons and said unto them, Be fruitful and multiply and replenish the earth. And the fear of you and the dread of you shall be upon every beast of the earth and upon every fowl of the air, upon 
all that moveth upon the earth and upon all the fishes of the sea. Into your hand are they delivered. Every morning a thing that liveth shall be meat for you, even as the green herb have I given you all things. But flesh with the life thereof, which is the blood thereof, shall ye not eat. And surely your blood of your lives will I require. At the hand of every beast will I require it, and at the hand of men, at the hand of every man's brother will I require the life of men. Whoso sheddeth man's blood, by man shall his blood be shed. For in the image of God made he man. Oh boy. Do you sleep here, Jacob? Ben sleeps here. I don't sleep. In the maggots? Whatever haunts the boy spawns maggots. We should talk to this Ben fellow. Hint obtained. The ghost spawns maggots in Jacob's Lynn's hovel. What is hovel? Uh, yikes. Can I take the gun, though? I would have liked to take the gun. Also, wait. Well, this is this is a camp, is it not? Can I can I can I camp here? I don't want to. <laughs> I don't camp in the maggots, honestly, though. Small dwelling. Okay, thank you. He's so confused. I doubt he knows what year it is. What happened to him? Maybe he was abandoned. Maybe he was always alone. Hmm. Maybe he was always alone. Maybe Ben is made up. Could be. Are you coming to life? Gosh. Death sure ain't pretty. Quick mist. Spun by a ghost after a violent death. Anisha row number eight. Don't get lost in quick mist, lest the spectres get you. Wise, <laughs> but I see no other way. Either Ben was lost in the mist, or he's the source of it. Oh, <gasps> I found a cool chest with runes on it. I want it. But I have a feeling I won't be able to get it because it has this rune mark thing in my bopsies around it, and I'm probably not able to unlock it yet. Oh. Oops. Just walking on planks already breaks it. Or can I? Spectral dust and witch stone. Oh, 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 oh. Somebody's angry about the loot that I stole. Sorry. Come here, you malaka. Chuck, am I looting these um, flasks <laughs> as well? Can I find them in the world, or are they only refilled, <laughs> refilled <laughs> by by resting? Oh God, man! Why is this button so attractive, huh? Why my my thumb is just drawn towards the X button for some reason? Horrible. Gotta be that physical things are more damage able from her and ghosts from him. And I think it's the other way around. So maybe I should have turned into Antea, if I understand correctly. You might be able to drop down from here. I'm able to jump over here. Oh, she means from here. Okay. Oh God. I do love a drop into the deep unknown. Can't see further than the end of my arm down there. <laughs> Don't worry, it'll affect your other senses too. Yay! <whistles> Am I taking oh, the rope with me? Quick mist is thicker than a Scots dragoon. <laughs> it smells almost as bad. <laughs> oh dear God! Oh Lord! Oh boy! Okay. Let's stick to the wall for now. I could show you the way. Just saying. Wait. That's, that's better. And a little terrifying. <laughs> Just saying.
Wait, there is traces of stuff that I can... This is locked. Everything points towards here. Or not. Maybe I'm confusing things. Okay, never mind. Do you see that? It looks like the fog is coming from those odd looking stuff. Hold on. Oh, sorry. I think I can rid us of the quick mist. Oh. Well, I'm partly made of the same stuff. Remove. Bam! Banish that. With a backhand bitch slap. <laughs> okay, so let me. Oh, you must no. be careful I did... now. I did not do that. I can't see. Ooh, ooh. Tree in the way, tree in the way. Come here, Malaka. Bam! I'm sorry. I didn't know that would happen. That's Got away okay. with it. Let's find what caused it. You mean, let's find out who died? <laughs> yes, exactly. Okay, we're supposed to... Aha, uh -huh, there. And traces of a struggle. An echo hangs on it. Perform ritual. Echo. Echo as in a memory? Then it would be the hearkening, right? Reveal an echo. Yes, okay. And now fail! And Shaw and Drast the Toki Min Fancy language. Oh. I can't. I can't do it no more. On your feet, Lind. We don't no. give up. I've had enough. There's no way up. There's no way down. For days we've eaten nothing but boiled shoe leather. I'm done. We don't give up. Leave me be. God be damned, I'm sick of carrying you. Oh my god, you. he pushed what him down. Do? Don't hurt me. He pushed him down. Oh, I hate you. I hate you! I think I know where Ben went. Ben died in the fall. And now his maggoty ghost is back to haunt the friend who pushed him. Did Jacob lie? Is Jacob delusional? Is Jacob delusional? Did he really forget what he did? Maybe his guilt got the better of his reason. We need to find the body. If the wolves haven't gotten there first. Mm. They probably have. Ay, ay, ay. Fear and hunger, very good motivators. Who's that? Yes. Something's here. In the water? Or where? <laughs> Wait, am I not supposed to find one of these traces and... Aha, there, go. okay, never mind, found it. And webs, spectral webs. Okay. I wonder if there will always be a voiced cue about stuff like this. Like, oh, something is here, you know, like she just said. Not Uncle Ben. I wanted to eat more rice. Oh no, there oh, he is. Oh, shite on a short stick. I 
Bloody hell. Man's been torn to pieces. No, wait. He's been carved with a knife. For his meat. Still no tie. A Jacob's hovel, perhaps? Oh. Jacob was Jacob like... Jacob was eating meat. Jacob was eating Ben. Poor desperate starving boys. Poor desperate starving boys. Sometimes you must do what it takes to survive. They were hungry. They were hungry before the fight. And he, Jacob was probably like, meat is meat is meat, right? Do you want some stew now? No, thanks. Nah. I'm glad that he didn't eat it now. <laughs> Imagine he was like, oh yeah, thanks. Okay, what do I do now with, with Jacob? Am I going the right way or the wrong way? Oh, hello. Ask for help if you need it. What are these things? What? Am I almost dead? Why am I, why am I sounding like this? What did I do? Suddenly almost dead. This guy is weird. I ain't eating his soup. Yeah, you're you're wise to not eat his soup. Follow my voice. What? Oh god. Possession in progress. Possession no! Oh god. There's a lot of enemies. Ooh, come here. I'm punching you in the chest. Punch, 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 punch. to wait for the attack but it came faster than expected like this. okay let's heal intentionally for change <laughs> is that a dog or a cow both <laughs> neither both i don't know some rotten mongrel. Hmm, there's a trap. Near the trapper's hut. Oh. Let's look for our tie while Jacob's outside. Tie. Tie to this world. The chunk of meat that was sitting on the table, this. Poor lad. His food is the meat of the matter. And tell you, that's horrible. Never heard a worse pun. <laughs> I like it. I never heard it was a pun. I like it. <laughs> I never loved you more. <laughs> Ew. Uh, bowl and spoon. A hand whittled wooden bowl and a spoon used by Jacob Lind. This tie is doused with the essence of the ghost. Once a closure has severed the ghost's bond to the world, this essence will be automatically consumed by Antea to make her stronger. I think I found our tie. How did I not notice it before? There were so many spectral stains, it's a wonder we found it at all. Okay, let's check out... Oh, poor lad. The ghost fixates on Jacob's bowl and spoon. 
the ghost spawns, maggots in Jacob's late hovel. Okay, we're not done though. There's more clues to be found, but we're apparently done with him. Jacob Lynn's friend Benedict Stoughton brings him food. Yeah, he does bring him food, but not this way. Jacob Lynn carved meat from Benedict Stoughton's body. Driven to disarray by weeks of nightmare driven sleep. Riven. Nightmare riven? Sleep? Jacob pushed Benedict off a cliff. Jacob Lynn killed and ate his companion Benedict. The dark woods. Eden Town. Uh -huh. There's quite a few of these quests. Come on, let's talk to Ben. To ben. Oh, we. Oh, 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 we. Oh, okay, okay. Perform ritual. I guess we make it now manifest, right? So we can talk to him. What did the ground ever do to you, Fred? Chant the words of power that will make the ghost manifest. You're not Jacob. Nope. Talk to the ghost. Who's you? My name is Red McCraith. The Scot. You? Antea Duarte. We're banishers. We can help you. I'm beyond help. Where's Jacob? Oh, he wants revenge. What keeps you here? You tried leaving this place. You tried many times to leave this place. I tried and failed. Week on week. Month on month, maybe. We went in circles. The woods are tricky, sir. Treacherous. Mean. Round and round we went. Round and round and back again. Jacob said you both had nightmares. The same nightmare. Aye. And yet we got no sleep. Couldn't tell truth from fantasy. The shadows seemed to flicker at the corners of our eyes. How long have you and Jacob been out here in the woods? Some winters now, but this one, it never ends. No way out, no way in. We were alone, not an animal in sight. No, when things changed, we got stuck. <laughs> These godforsaken woods. We know what befell you, Benedict. What keeps you here? He does. He waits and waits and waits on me. He'll not face what he has done, and I cannot go. I cannot go. But I'll not hate him. How could I? He seems lost. I want to believe that he's lost, but does it make that true? How do I know? Hmm. We thought him lost. In mind and reason. Who not lose their mind? Stuck in place for weeks on end, deprived of a living, deprived of a life. Though I denied it, I saw it coming. I became wary. Some part of me knew what he was thinking, because I was thinking it too. Eating the other? What do you want from Jacob? What do you want from Jacob? Do you seek revenge? I seek no vengeance. He is I, and I am him. What does he need? What does he need that he may let go? He needs to face the truth. To accept what he has done to both of us. At night, he'd read scripture. God would mind us if we were good and honest. Jacob taught me that. We were good. We lived honest lives. We kept to ourselves, minded our business, and no one else's. So tell me, Banisher, what did we do to deserve this? This was beyond you. 
This was not God's doing. Another powerful entity is at work here. New Eden is cursed. Then God has forsaken us, and we are doomed. Thank you, Benedict. Perhaps we'll talk again. Perhaps we shall, Banisher. Perhaps we shall. Maybe I need to banish him. For good. The ghost spawns maggots. Uh, the ghost of Benedict wants the truth to out. The ghost of Benedict Stoughton wants Jacob Lynn to tell the truth and admit his cannibalism. Okay, well then, we have to Jacob try and make him... Confess. The truth will break him. His denial runs strong. Yeah. His denial runs strong. He must have loved Ben very much. Bring closure. Oh, there's you, Jacob. Mr. McCraith, sir? Have you tried leaving? You were struggling yourself and Ben. Why do you not leave? Leave? No, can't leave. This here is home. We trap here, we eat here, we tan pelt to leather here. Our lives are here. Can't leave. Did you not try the river? The fog had to lift some time, and if you stay, you'll starve. We have enough. Thanks to Ben. But you did try to leave, didn't you? You packed up and left. Do you not remember reaching the cliff top? Cliff top makes a fine lookout. Game comes to the water to drink. You can pick him off if in your aim be good enough. Has he lost his mind? Or is he tricking with us? I can't tell. I'm sorry, Jacob, we must talk. Something has happened to Benedict. What? Where is he? What happened? Come on now, Jacob. If something's happened to Ben, say so. Where is he? You need to remember. Benedict is in pain. For his sake, you need to remember what happened. You need to remember what you did. But I... No. I would never. I couldn't hurt him. I love him. Jacob, look at me. It's safe to remember. Now tell me, what happened on that cliff top? I was tired. So tired. Hunger was digging holes in me, burning in my throat. I could think of nothing else. We don't give up. We don't give in. But I wanted to. I wanted it all to stop. So you made it stop. So you made it stop. Do you remember now? I failed him. I failed Benedict. I was so angry. So angry. He kept pushing me. We kept. We argued. And I couldn't think. When I saw him lying there, on the ground, lifeless, the whisper said, It was him or me. Him or me. I would have died. I should have died. For my sins, I deserve no better. I failed God. I failed my friend. I'm a monster. I deserve no mercy. No. You're just a sinner, begging for help. We both faced a choice, simple and awful, 
to kill or to die. You struck first and here we are. Do you forgive me? Our fates are in the hands of others now. Okay. Yes. Banisher, do your job. If you're to come back, if we're to use the ritual we spoke of, this is when it starts. Red. If we take one step along that path... Jacob is ready to die. The others won't be. We'll tell lies. We'll harvest the essence of the living. I'll shoulder the blame. As the man says, we face a choice, simple and awful. Do we kill? To be together again? Or do we part forever? We must decide now. I must decide now? You have reached the closure of a haunting case. As a banisher, you must decide. Blame the haunted inhabitant, ascend the ghost, or banish the ghost. Oh, I feel like I'm lacking information here. Blame the haunted in inhabitant. She, she would have liked if we banished, right? Ascend the ghost means I send him to the heavens or just to a better place? Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. But he himself seems to like the ascend part. Each choice will have consequences. Specifically on the way Red and Antea evolve as a couple. Reminder, if Red wishes to bring Antea back to life, he must blame the largest number of living settlers. I don't think it's it's a good idea to to bring her back. As much as much as I kind of would like them to be back together, it won't ever be as it was, I think. So I won't bring her back, I think. I don't think this is a good idea, so I'm not going to do that. Um But he himself would like to... Oh, you can get some information. You will sacrifice the settler with a blame ritual. This decision will contribute to Antea's resurrection, since a resurrection ritual will only work if the largest amount of settlers are sacrificed. Okay. You will greatly, gently let the ghost ascend from this world with a release ritual. This decision will contribute to Antea's ascend. Yeah, I wanted to ascend. You will forcefully forcedly, sorry, banish the ghost to oblivion with the banishment ritual. This decision will contribute to Antia's ascent. Also, I think I'm gonna banish evil ghosts and ascend good ghosts. Like, he doesn't seem to be angry or or vengeful or anything, so I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna ascend him. Benedict Stoughton. In the face of life's inexplicable hardships, at times, to stay alive, we must do terrible things. In his despair, your best friend stole your life. Then, he compounded his sin. He fed on your flesh. Confessing his sins, he offered to forfeit his life. He has told the truth. You may go in peace. We were trapped. The snare was set to kill us slow. Jacob, my friend, my only friend. I forgive all. I forgive everything.
It's over, Jacob. Ben's gone for good. Ben's been gone a long time. I know that now. I need to give him his last right. Please. I need to be alone. It's over. The tie will sustain me a little longer. Jacob, would you mind if I rest inside a while? Suit yourself. That was so beautifully made, I think. The animation of, of his ascension. Very, very well done. Oh man, I almost cried there. It was, that was so well done. Does that mean I'm, I get to rest on the maggot place now, or is it- No more maggots. Oh, good, thank you. <laughs> ben is gone for good. Yeah, no thanks. I'm not hungry. Okay, rest upon the hovel. Leap. Antea can cross ethereal portals that act like shortcuts through the invisible into the incarnate. In combat, Antea can dash towards enemies, dealing a small amount of damage. The leap manifestation has been unlocked after the consumption of the essence soaking benefit. Oh, okay. Um, is it only for her that I have two skill points now? Six cents. Parrying restores spirit points. Ooh. Charged heavy attacks damage is increased by 20%. What is this? Hmm. I don't have whatever it is, I don't have it. Kindred. The fourth heavy attack triggers a punch attack that ignores resistance. And damage dealt by red is increased by 30% against full health enemies. <laughs> Guaranteed more damage? I like it. And this. Oh, do I have to... Oh, do I have to... Unveil is for him and leap is for her. I'm confused. Rest. Are you sure you want to rest? Yes. I need I need those potions. Oh, they're cuddling. You know. I think in the beginning of the game, when she was about to banish um, Charles, their friend, she was so con convinced that everybody should be banished. Um, I don't know if she would like to be brought back. And I don't know if I should have sent her or, or banish her in the end. She was like, Charles would do the same, blah, 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 blah. Or well, the old Charles would do the same. So I don't know yet, but I don't know if the ritual of bringing her back is the way to go. We have upgrades for this. Oops, sorry. Uh, how do I do this? Upgrades. So if I have upgrade options, I can only upgrade certain objects. Okay, what is evolution again? This, okay. Nice. <sighs> that man killed and ate his friend. When I was a soldier, I heard many stories of those besieged eating their own. Some were true. Famine is a ferocious master. Jacob was hungry. Yeah, just like you. Just like me. How do you feel? I feel trapped, locked into an embrace with a nightmare. I crave, I crave essence. With it, I'd not so fast decay. With it, I'd not so quickly become one of those stupid bloody specters. Maybe we should reconsider. We made the right choice. We made the right choice. We made it together. Taking a life is no small matter. When I ascend, we'll be separated for the rest of your life. 
maybe for the rest of eternity. Never again shall we stand side by side. This we, this thing we have, shall cease to be. Red is about to swear an oath to Antea, and together they will choose her fate. Oof! Like, how they already made me commit to something in the beginning of the bloody game. <laughs> Choices you make when bringing closure impact your chances to fulfill the promise made to one another. Remember, you remain free to make any choice you want when bringing closure, no matter the oath you have sworn, as long as you are ready to face the consequences. How, how can I decide who deserves to live and who deserves to die just because I love her? The person I might kill or sacrifice, or all the people, I have to, I have to sacrifice a multitude of, of beings, of humans, to bring her back. Is that justified? I don't think so. So I think I, I lean towards ascend. Red swears he will help Antea's ghost peacefully leave this world once they retrieve her body from New Eden's meeting house. Red swears he will help Antea come back to life once they retrieve her body from New Eden's meeting house. To keep this oath, Red will have to sacrifice as many settlers as possible with a blame ritual. Oh, hold, sorry. <laughs> right. That's that settled. Glad Thank we talked. You. I hope you've no regrets. Or you. For soon, you'll release me. I'll have my assent. I hardly want to let you go. I know, but you must. Hurricane. I am a shadow, caged and fading. You are still here? Still you? We could Jacob Lynn's essence called to me. I knew it wrong, but I desired it. There lies perdition for both of us. I cannot abide what I have become. I don't want to abandon you, but I must. So be it. My love, we will reclaim your body. You'll have your ascent. I swear it. A promise made, take your oath. Hungry, the hunter's quest completed. Ooh, I mean, it's a hard decision to make to decide whether you want to have your beloved back or not. But I don't think it's worth taking the lives of many other people. And yes, right now, Jacob might be willing to, to give his life, but I doubt that the others will. And I don't want to kill people just to save one life. How many, how many lives is her life worth? <laughs> you know, yes, I will miss her, but... She can, she, she, she's dead already. The only person right now left who's mourning is him. So he, he can choose to suffer, right? Um, I don't know. I feel like this is the, especially since before, before when she was still alive and she was about to banish Charles, she was like the dead have no business with the living and everything. Like everything she said, I was listening. She, 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 she I think the old her, would tell us that she needs to go, and either through banishment or through Ascension. I think Ascension is more his way, and we're playing him, so I guess that's what we do. Um, but yeah, hard decision to make, I, I say. Alrighty, guys, I had a blast playing this, and I cannot wait to continue. Um, tomorrow is a day off, so we will continue on Wednesday, and then I'm looking forward to the weekend where we can play Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. I'm really looking forward to that really enjoying this game is gorgeous and the the stories are very interesting um so far like this little i think this was just a side quest or something or like a bigger side quest really really cool really cool so far so yeah we will continue here on wednesday guys <laughs>